Welcome to my channel, Mallorca Under the Sun, and I'm down here in Alcudia. Now I'm starting my evening in Alcudia Port. We're going to take a little look around, see what there is to eat and drink, check out the atmosphere, and I'm going to give you an idea of prices too. So let's go and check it out. Now I'm on Mariner Street, which has so many restaurants here, and my first stop is the Indian. So if you are a vegan or vegetarian, that's a great place to come and get some amazing food. Or even if you're not actually, it's a fantastic restaurant, and it's one of the restaurants that's open year round down here. But first, I head on over to Calle Toretta, which runs parallel to check out the bars. So Craig, can you tell me how much is a pint of beer over in Shamrocks? Local lager, we sell Estrella at €3.50. Okay, so how much is a glass of wine as well? It's €3 Euro we offer, uh, Mallorca wine, um, rosé, dry or sweet, €3 Euro because we can buy that directly from the island. So. That's brilliant. Thanks very much for talking to me Craig, have a good evening. And you, thank you. And next door to Shamrocks is Robbie's Sports Bar, which is a great place for a game of pool and also to watch the sport. So right next to the Irish pubs, you've got um, Manolos and they do a mixed tapas for 27 euros. They do a whole choice of dishes and that's for two people. Now I'm outside a Pam Bolleria here and this is the Jucalo. Loads of locals eating in here, so if you're coming out for a light bite and a pamboli is that rustic bread that you can get with either meat or cheese and that looks like a great place to come and the kitchen is open until 11pm. And I'm standing outside the Recoleta here and they do a special tapas menu for two people for €12.90. Euros. They also have like a whole big choice of dishes too, so definitely worth coming to check out. Now outside a really cool looking restaurant here is called Moon. Yes, Moon, I think I'm pronouncing that correctly. Really good value meals here. They serve food until midnight as well. So if you're looking for a really light bite, then definitely pop in here too. So pizza dishes are in the region of nine euros 95. And you can also get some pamboli as well for around 16 euros. Just passing by another Irish pub here. Quite a few Irish pubs down here in the port. And of course, there are tons of ice cream shops too. Ramon's Bar is a favourite down here in the port too. It's looking very busy in here. Just looking at the food too, you've got um, starters from around sort of five euros fifty to around eight euros, and other main dishes from about eight euros. Now this is what I love to see down here. We've got loads of visitors down here in Alcudia Port this evening. The atmosphere is absolutely fantastic. It's quite late on in the evening too, but still people are staying out and having even more drinks. Now it's a great time to come shopping down here in Alcudia Port if it's too hot during the day. There's a great shoe shop here as well. They've already got the sales on as well, so you can pick up yourself a nice pair of sandals in between drinks and in between dinner. So we're going to have a look at the main Paseo Maritimo down here in Alcudia Port. A very famous ice cream restaurant here too, just dedicated to serving some amazing ice creams. And plenty more restaurants down here. But the main vibe this evening is that people coming out walking and there's such a lovely family atmosphere here and this is the one thing that I really do love about going out in Mallorca is that you see people of all ages out. The atmosphere is really nice down here. So if you're coming out this summer, this is what you have to look forward to. Now I'm even coming up to another ice cream restaurant here. Ice cream is obviously huge down here in Alcudia. When it's this hot, and it has been hot today, and it's the one thing that everyone wants to eat. Now, I have to point out this restaurant too. This is the Cespiga Pizzeria. Now, this is probably going to be the best value that you're going to get down here in Alcudia Port, and I'll show you why. 
So everything on the menu here is just seven euros. Now it was six euros last year, but they've only put the meals that buy one euro, which really does represent amazing value. So you can get anything here from pasta or pizza or tapas for seven euros. Now what's absolutely fantastic during the summer months down in Alcudia Port is that they do have an evening market too. So you can come down here and pick up some fantastic souvenirs. Now I seem to remember picking one of these up for my daughter as well when she was really small. And the little handmade puzzles, absolutely fantastic. You have to, you have to come down and get them. Of course they've got some jewellery stalls here. And most of this stuff as well, it's all handmade by the local artists down here too. And you can get some really nice little souvenirs as well for your home. Now it's quite late on in the evening here and the restaurant Negro is still really busy and people are still going on in to eat. Now as you may know, dinner over here in New York tends to start from about 8pm but it can go on until around midnight. I love everyone's down here getting a picture in front of the Alcudia sign. Alcudia Town Hall, I think you need to put some lights on it. Get it lit up. Now, of course, if you want some amazing views of Alcudia Port at night, then come up to this little walkway to check out the lights. So coming back up to Alcudia Port, it's just so lovely just to walk along where the boats are as well, right by the water. It's actually quite nice and cooling as well. You get a nice cool breeze from the water, even on a hot day. Now, this area that I'm standing underneath is an area where they often hold fiestas and dancing. So if you're coming over this summer, expect to find some fun things happening down here too. Now, if you're visiting with kids, then head on down to the Alcudia Mar Dock because they do have some little fairground rides too for children. Got some more market stalls for adults. But as you can see in front of me, you can see some fairground rides and the great bouncy castle too. Now this market really is fantastic. You can see it stretches all the way down the dock here. Absolutely fantastic to come after dinner. Now I'm just down here right at the start of Alcudia Beach and you can see that the restaurants which line this beach are still busy. Everyone's having a great time. Now you can see the Sagavina Beach Club is looking quite lively this evening. A lot of people have already had their dinner, so they're going out for even more drinks. It's a great atmosphere down here. Looking really busy. Now cocktails down here are quite pricey. They're, they're around eight to 10 euros. But just check out the views that you get from these restaurants here. We've got so many people down here enjoying the beach still. And we're rolling into very late on in the evening here. The kids are still up. I mean, it's just great to see. So if you're looking for a restaurant that also has some live music and a cocktail bar, then head up to Muddy's. Got some great food up there. And also just right next door as well, you've got the Grand Chinese Restaurant too. Okay, so you can see I'm surrounded by many more bars and restaurants and shops down here in Alcudia Port. But I hope that gives you a really good idea of what to expect when you're coming out here this summer. Now, do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Don't forget you can find me in the Facebook group and also on my Instagram, also called Mallorca Under the Sun. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Goodbye for now.